So this one, the first one is always just a straight up uh, use the force of gravity formula, right? So this is going to be force is G, and G is this number, right? So it's 6.67. And then I'm going to write an E there, because that's what I'm going to do with my calculator, minus 11, right? And then um, it's a planet and a moon, right? So 6.90E25, right? And then 4.3E22. All these numbers in scientific notation, right? And then uh, their distance, it's separated by that much. This is 5.7E8. And we want, to, we want to square that. Don't forget to square this, OK? Uh, these parentheses are not necessary, but it will work, right? You can actually, the denominator, you can leave the parentheses off, OK? So 6.67, second comma, so E minus 11 times uh, 6.9E. And that's 25, right? And then times 4.3e22 divided by 5.7e8. And then square that. Don't forget to square the denominator. And I'm getting uh, 6.09107. And then it says e20, right? So that's 6.09 times 10 to the 20th newtons. There you go. So this one's just plug the numbers in. Can you do the scientific notation, right? Okay. And remember that this this number here, this looks like this in the calculator, 6.67 e minus 11, right? 